budgeting forms one of the bases for an improved economy. If properly done, the dividends of democracy are eminent. To gather input towards a robust 2023 fiscal year, the authorities of Yaba Local Council Development Area invited key stakeholders to its annual consultative forum themed Budget of Accelerated Growth. Present at the consultative forum were traditional, religious, and political leaders, the management team, lawmakers, as well as residents. In his keynote address, the council chairman, Yaba LCD, Kayo Deomiyale said the meeting is geared towards improving the living conditions of stakeholders while reiterating the council's commitment in delivering the dividends of democracy to all and sundry. He noted that the 2023 budget will touch across all sectors within the area. The rules and regulation is the constitutional requirement that before the government can spend anything, the first thing to have is the budget. And what are we calling, what is the budget? Budget is a sort of uh, estimated plan of what and what we want to do the next year. How we are going to spend the money, how we are going to generate the money. How method we are going to generate the money and how we are going to spend it. And in the purpose, we must know the requirements in each constituency. And what I mean constituency, like in our local government, we have nine words. We have 48 CDAs. 48 CDAs. And we want to make sure that we put at least all the aspects of our local government. All the political words within the area were fully represented. During the interactive session, stakeholders bear their minds on some of their concerns, which centers on block drainage leading to the canal, road infrastructure, quality health care, and education support. Unlike past government or administration, they don't give people voice as against their own odd. The present government will call people to express their feelings. Most of the times they will tell you to put your feelings in writing. So that is why we appreciate this. It is very good that all the community leaders, all the chairman, the uh, ward chairman, the supervisors, all the ballots and the KBC, everybody was present to tell us, to tell the government what we need for our community, to put it in the budget for next coming year. The economy is just speaking of, and the local government is looking at how they can ensure that all sectors of the economy are catered for. That's why we will start the accelerated growth, that every sector in the locality will be touched one way or the other to ensure that everybody is brought on board to feel the dividend of democracy that we're actually uh, turning out in here by LCD. So that was why we looked at everything critically and said that, okay, if we, have, if we must touch on all the sectors, we have to ensure that we have a growth that can be felt. And we're going to do this with all vibrancy that will speak to our result at the end of the day. Speaking with newsmen, the executive chairman said the meeting is aimed at ensuring adequate planning of the 2023 budget, adding that the information gathered will enable the council to prioritize the needs of the nine wards. I have presented them what and what the area want to cover the next year. As I've said, it's just an estimation. It's a proposal. Uh, even we government, we may not able to fulfill all our wants. So also, as we have listened to them, virtually all the nine wards and uh, CDAs, they have presented their request. Uh, we are going back to look at those things, study their merit, uh, and we are going to select, you know, the area that we can cover in the coming year. The people of Yaba LCD are optimistic that their yearnings would be catered for come 2023. In another development, lawmakers representing the council's political wards 
have been given operational vehicles to enhance efficient service delivery. According to the chairman, Omiyale said the vehicles will aid mobility at work, especially when the legislators are carrying out their oversight functions. We are giving them this vehicle in order to make the assignment to be easy. You know, as the uh, leaders in their various wards, they need to attend to so many people. As they are attending to their people, so also they must attend to the government assignment. So, and many of them, they are coming from far distances. So we need to give them what will make their job to be easier. It's not for luxury. It's a necessity for them to easy their movement. And it, 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 is, it is very necessary for them. And uh, we, we are not going to abandon. For giving them the vehicle, that is not going to be the end of our assignment. We are still going to follow them on how to maintain it. Uh, you know, to a certain extent, we expect them that they will use it maximally for the benefit and development of this local government. With this initiative, no doubt, Yaba LCD is poised for greatness. Thank you.